You're the best baby in the whole wide world and I'm gonna miss your little face. I'm gonna miss your body. I'll be back. We'll begin our quest. Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the vlogs. We are crazy at 508, no, 501 a.m. We are about to leave and go to Seattle. I've never flin it, flown. I can't even talk. <laughs> My words just aren't coming out right. I've never flown four hours and 55 minutes before. I'm used to, if you guys don't know, I live in Ohio. I'm used to like two hour, 30 minute border flights. So fingers crossed that this goes okay. But we are meeting my mom and dad at the airport, and then we are going to take off. And I just realized I think they have all of our documents, so I probably should text them. All right. Talk to you guys in a little bit. We just said bye to Blue. He breaks my little heart, but I know he will have fun. I have a girl staying at my house, um, Lindsay, who actually is one of my friends, and she's going to take care of my house and my animals. So I think we're all set. All right. Well, let's go to the airport, children. made it to Seattle. Am I all blurry? Probably. But we are looking for an Uber XL is what we need. Something like a Suburban to get us to the Kempton Hotel. Right, Jen? Okay. Let's find where we're going. Everyone, we are now here in downtown Seattle. We have a couple places to go. Give myself what? We're gonna go to the first Starbucks. We're gonna go to Pike Place Market, which I heard is amazing. It's where they like they throw fish and things. And we are going to go down to like the pier. So I'm excited to take you guys with us. And it smells like sea. That is really neat. I don't think I've ever seen a real live jellyfish. Me too. You think that That's crazy. located 2000 Western Avenue from 71 to 76. This cafe later moved to 1912 Pike Place. That's it. The 1912? Yep. Susan. Oh 
what you think? Now we're gonna go try to find somewhere to sit down and have something to eat. I think over back by the water back where we came from, but we can't check into our hotel until four o'clock. So we have some time to kill. So that is what we're doing. We're just walking. Walking around. Come on. What time is it? We are finally in our room. This is such a swanky hotel. Um, I'm excited just to lay down. He's going to deliver our luggage in a minute. Are we actually going to um, stay in our room? Just for tonight. Because we board the cruise ship tomorrow. I forget if I explained that to you guys. Um, we're in Seattle and we board from Seattle to go up to Alaska. But that is not until tomorrow morning. So we're spending the night here. Right? I'm trying to go in the bed. But we're all kind of slap heavy. Because it has been a long day. <laughs> One odd fact about this room is there is no coffee maker, which is... I find that absolutely crazy. But maybe because this is like the coffee mecca of the United States. That they just think that you should go get one. I'm not sure. But we are chilling out. Cody just took Jet to go get a haircut downstairs. It's like a little Aveda place. So hopefully they do a good job. Um, I'm sure they will. But yeah, we're just gonna chill out and then I'm not sure what we'll do for dinner, but we had quite a big lunch. I'm really excited because there is a gym. I will show you guys it either later on tonight or tomorrow. Um, did I show you it before when we came and visited? I can't remember if I took a little shot of it or not. But if I did, I'll insert it right here. If I didn't, I'll show you guys it once I go there. But it, they have two. They have like a main gym, which is downstairs, and then they have a primarily cardio gym which is up here honestly on the fourth floor we're on the fourth floor literally like four rooms down so i know cody will definitely use it and so will i uh but yeah i wanted to update you guys we are going to chill out since we have been the channel just change um since we've been on the go since 3 30 i'm not too sure what time it is here i want to say it's like three o'clock their time so it's like six or seven back at home which to me is late all right i'm gonna go okay bye and p.s i know that my dog is in really good hands by Lindsay. god love her uh, but i do really miss him already that's all i like keep thinking about and i made my home screen of my phone and my wallpaper his picture because i miss him a lot i miss all my pets all three of them all right a little update, I just got out of the shower about an hour ago and right when I got out, my dad and Cody decided they were gonna take my kids to 
the Space Needle. I don't even know what it's called. You know, the big like Seattle like landmark thing that's like really popular here. They're going there, but I'm also gonna clean off the lens because you guys are smudgy. Hold on. Hopefully that's a little bit better. Um, but they went there. I'm actually gonna hit up the gym that I told you guys about that's a couple doors down. I'll show you once I get there. But they have a Peloton bike, which I've always wanted to try because I see the commercials on TV. So we're gonna go see if anybody's in there. If nobody's in there, because you guys know I'm shy, um, then we're gonna get a little bit of a workout in. If somebody is in there, then we're gonna come back here and maybe do some crunches on the floor or something. Okay, let's go. So I decided on this bike. I'm talking quietly because there's rooms all around me um, instead of that because I cannot figure out how to um, move that seat down right there. So this will be, this will be fine. And then I might get on that. I'm back in the room eating Swedish fish because that's what everybody eats after they're done working out. Um, the bicycle was awesome. Definitely might do it again tomorrow morning. I did like a 20 minute power workout. I don't know, stuck in my teeth. But it is 6.30 here, so it's 9.30 at home, which is like the time that my kids go to bed. So I asked Cody, my mom, and my dad are down at like the bar that's in a hotel, and they're gonna pick up some food to go. So I'm gonna bring it up here. But I thought that I would say goodnight to everybody. And I will see you guys tomorrow when we get on the boat. Bye, everyone.